Who's my favorite guy in the world? It's Louis Gohmert. Okay, he's a Republican knucklehead of the first order. I literally have never seen a tape of Louis Gohmert that didn't make me laugh out loud. Okay, every time I watch the first time, I'm like, that, Louis, that's another good one, because he has the craziest conspiracy theories. Okay, you ready for the next one? He says Obama is trying to back, bring back an empire. The American empire? Wow, okay, well, I mean, maybe he's going too far with the drone strikes and the wars, etc. No, no, no. The Ottoman Empire. Thank you, President Barack Hussein Obama. This will be quite a legacy for you. And I'm not one of those who says he's not a Christian. All I know is that's between him and God. But what I do know is he has helped jumpstart a new Ottoman Empire and left our friend and ally Israel so vulnerable in this sea of radicalism that he has helped bring to the surface. I mean, and you look across Tunisia, and Libya, and Egypt, and Iraq, and Iran, and Syria, Lebanon, you look at these countries, you look and you go, oh my gosh, this is the ba makings, this is the beginnings, a massive beginning of a new Ottoman Empire that President Obama can take great credit for. <laughs> Come on, that's awesome. The Ottoman Empire is back. I didn't know that, man. I didn't get the memo. You would have thought I'd be the first one to get the memo. I can't wait to be a Padishah again or a Sultan. Where's my harem? What's happening? I didn't know we we're putting the army back together. Okay, now look, look, the great irony of this insane conspiracy theory is the Ottoman Empire was an empire, it wasn't a democracy. They weren't asking people's opinion. They didn't go to Greece and they didn't go to Syria and they didn't go to all those places and go, hey, would you like to be ruled by us? And they were like, no, here's a new boss in town. His name is Osman. That's the original Padishah of the Ottoman Empire that started it all. So, in reality here, what's happening in Tunisia, Libya, it's, and Egypt, etc., is democracy. What the Republican Party claimed to stand for in the first place. Remember the freedom agenda by Bush? Now that there's been a democracy, they say, oh, goddamn democracy? That's going to start the Ottoman Empire again. That's what Hussein Obama's real agenda is. And I love how he says, oh, no, I'm not saying he's not a Christian. I guess that's between him and his God. He'll have to answer for that. I mean, Hussein! Gomert! Gomert! That's a good one, man. If you paid me money to come up with a wilder conspiracy theory, I'm not sure I could do it.